Cheers. Good morning from Las Vegas. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the video so far. Comment down below if you are. Now, in today's video, we're gonna be going on a mega cheap eats food tour of Las Vegas. Now everybody says that you can't do Vegas cheaply, but I take that quite personally as a budget traveler. So in this video, I'm gonna prove those haters wrong. Now the first stop that we're going to today is Miracle Mile Shots, right on the middle of the strip to La Salsa Cantina, the cheapest breakfast in Las Vegas. Right, here we are guys, La Salsa Cantina. Oh, look at that. 6.99 breakfast, mate, that is me. Can I just get a table for one, please? Right guys, so for 6.99 breakfast, you get two eggs, any style, and you get bacon or sausage and tortillas and potatoes. Mate, that is a great deal. I think I'm gonna go for the bacon. All hey, right, can I just get the 6 99 breakfast, please? Uh, can I get it with poached eggs? We don't need the poached eggs. Scramble or vermilion or bacon or sunny side up? Uh, sunny side up, please. Bacon, ham or side up? Uh, bacon, please. Uh, bacon, please. Uh, can I, do you have sparkling water? Uh, sparkling water. Every time I say sparkling water, they're like, what? And they always say soda water. Soda water is the one that comes out of the tap. That's literally just fizzy tap water. Nah, I'm not down. I want sparkling mineral water, you know what I mean? Mate, this place is actually sick. Proper like Mexican themed diner. And then you got the bar right there with all the neon signs. Mate, this is sick. I'm not gonna lie, I'm absolutely loving it in here. Oh, lovely, thank you very much. You're Cheers, welcome. thank you. Oh, guys, look at that. Now, I'm not being funny, but that is absolutely delicious looking. Right, guys, here we go. We've got the crispy bacon, we've got the sunny side up eggs, and we've got the potatoes with onions and peppers. Mate, that is a bit of meat, right? A bit of salt on the eggs and a bit of pepper as well, of course. The only thing about the eggs in America, well, Las Vegas, should I say, when they say sunny side up, it's like, it's all gooey and runny on the top. Like, it's not, I like sunny side up, but when it's uh, a little bit cooked on the top, when it's just that layer of film just cooked. Anyway, I'm gonna eat it anyway, because it looks absolutely delicious, right? Let's try a bit of this bacon and egg first. Or oh, dip that bacon in the yolk, yeah, boy. Mmm. Oh my God, that egg is incredible. Forget what I just said. Right, let's try some of these potatoes. Oh, actually, let me put a little bit more salt on the potatoes. Yeah, lovely. Bit of pepper. See, when you have chips or potatoes, you've got to put salt and pepper. You know what I mean? It's an elite combo. Right, let's have a bit of this potato. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, they're so fresh and banging. Right, let's try these peppers as well. Oh, man. Mate, honestly, if you're not doing the onion, and pepper combo with your potatoes, mate, you're missing out, genuinely. Mm. Absolutely delicious. Mm. Do you know what I will say about America? Their bacon is incredible. They know how to do bacon. Listen, yeah, the eggs are really nice, but this is what I mean. You see when it's all like, a little bit snotty? Yeah, not the biggest fan of that. But to be honest, without the snot, the egg's very nice. Mate, I need to smash these onions and peppers because I have not had that many vegetables since I've been here, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, guys, honestly, that was so good. I left a little bit because I don't wanna eat all of it because I wanna eat a lot of food today. So I don't wanna stuff myself. I wanna leave some room for later. But honestly, incredible. 6.99, what an absolutely impeccable deal. Right, let's go, guys. On to our next mission, on to our next bit of food. Mate, I'm not gonna lie, the staff in here are absolutely wonderful. Genuinely, so polite, so friendly, and just lovely. Cheers, thank you very much, thank you. Mate, shout out to La Salsa Cantina. Honestly, that was just brilliant. Like, just brilliant, good food. I feel like a lot of food in America, I'm eating it and I'm like, ooh. And now for the inevitable stomach ache in about five minutes, sometimes even less than that, but no, absolutely incredible scran. Oh guys, honestly, it's absolutely gorgeous weather here. Blue skies literally every day, mate. In March, Las Vegas is incredible. I don't think that I could deal with the 40 degree heat in the summer. Like that's just not me, in it? Absolutely not. Duck me out, geezer. Right guys, that food was absolutely delicious, but I left quite a lot of it on purpose. It was just a little teaser, a little taster of what's to come. And I'm still quite hungry, to be honest. So the next place that we're going to is a little bit off the beaten track. Sort of, as you can see by these surroundings, it's, uh, it's not on the main strip. So the place that we're going to is called Ellis Island Casino. It's known for being like a, a grottier, smaller little casino. And basically they do a pizza slice for $3.50. Now that is 100% 
guaranteed the cheapest pizza in Las Vegas. I've seen so many pizzas here for like five, some of them even $10 for one slice, for a single slice. Absolutely ridiculous. So yeah, we're gonna go there and we're gonna get our lovely $3.50 pizza slice. Hopefully it's good. You know, my standards of pizza slices are quite high. I've had 99 cent pizza from New York, which was absolutely incredible. And Joe's pizza, which was just pff, probably the best pizza I've ever had in my life. So yeah, hopefully it can keep the high standards in Vegas. Right, so here we are guys, Ellis Island. You can't miss it. It's literally right opposite the high roller. You literally cannot miss it. Right, so the place is called Metro Pizza and you can actually get a two topping slice for like $4, but nah, we'll go for the one topping slice. Sorry, mate. Oh, right, let's go. Let's go and find this bloody pizza, shall we? Okay, oh, right there. Literally right by the entrance. Absolutely lovely. Oh, let's have a look at these pizzas, shall we? Oh, wow, 320. It's not even 350, it's 320. It's even cheaper. What an absolute bargain. Oh, mate, look at the size of them as well. Absolutely laughing. Honestly, that's insanely cheap. The cheapest one that I've seen in Vegas so far was like $6. I looked everywhere and this is the cheapest one I could find. Can I just get uh, one slice of cheese pizza, please? One slice of cheese. Yeah, thank you. Oh, it's Gotham pizza. What's a Gotham pizza? <laughs> Lovely, thank you very much. Cheers, thank you. Oof. Mate, these pizzas look unreal. You know when they just look crunchy? That's what I love. Thin crust, crunchy pizza. I like the fact that it's not deep pan. Forget deep pan pizza, mate. You lot that like deep pan pizza, you're wrong -uns. So the cheese is 320, one topping 350, two toppings 375. Mate, that is so cheap. Oh, lovely. Thank you so much. Perfect. Thank you. Oof. Look at that cool little box as well. Right, let's go find somewhere to eat this. Oh, mate, nice and hot as well. Right, let me try and find somewhere to put this camera. I want to get a nice backdrop. Right, there we go. Oh, absolutely lovely. Right, let's do the big reveal, shall we? Metro Pizza. Oh, mate, look at that. Do we get a cheese pool? I wonder. Let's have a little go. Oh, it's a bit floppy, but I don't care. It looks banging. Oh. What a cheese ball. Oh my God. Very, very cheesy. Oh, that tangy marinara sauce as well. Incredible. Oh my God, guys. Yeah, boy. Mm. Mm. Mate. Oh my God, it's never ending. It's like a magic trick. Oh my God, right. Let's try a bit of that crust as well. Mm. Oh, wow. Oh my God. That is incredible crust. Mate, I'm not gonna lie. $3.20. You can't find a better deal on pizza than that. Absolutely not. Shout out to Metro Pizza, boy. Oh my God, guys, that pizza was absolutely delicious, but I'm very thirsty now. So I wanna go and get an ice cold beverage. And I've just seen out of the blue, mate, 7-Eleven. Now I know they do these little, what are they called, like slushies? Like the, I, I don't know what the actual name for it is, but they're like slushies, like uh, squishies from the Quickie Mart in The Simpsons. And they are absolutely incredible. I tried one in New York and it was unreal. So I'm gonna go get another one of them for you now. I think it's only like two or three dollars. So it definitely counts as a cheap budget option. Right, let's go. Ah, oh, thank you. In a London accent as well. Nice and welcoming. Okay, let's see if they do them in here. Do they? Oh, I don't know if they do. We've got the coffee machine, another coffee machine. Oh, I'm gonna be absolutely gutted if they haven't got a squishy machine. <laughs> oh no, oh, what's that? Nah, more coffee. Oh, that's disappointing. Oh wait, no, I found it. Yes. <laughs> oh my God, yeah boy. Oh, look at this, Slurpee. That's what it's called, Slurpee, right. I tried the blue raspberry flavor last time. And to be honest, absolutely foolproof. I, I can't fault it at all. Let's have a look at the prices as well. Mate, a large is $1.99. It's literally cheaper than water, right? Let's go for the large. That's a large. That's not really a large. I forget that. Let's go for the extra large. It's only like 50 cents more. Yeah, that's what I'm feeling, right? Let's go for this blue raspberry, shall we? Let's get that squishy. <laughs> oh my God. 
That is so huge. Mate, 299 or 249, I don't know which it is, but that's absolutely incredible either way. Do they have lids? Um, oh, I don't know if, the, oh, do you know what? Forget the lid. I'm literally just gonna use a, just gonna use a straw. Forget it, doesn't matter. 250 for this, or even if it's $3, that's absolutely insane. Right. Are you right, mate? Just that, please. All right. Do you have a rewards number you want to use? Uh, I don't. Okay, about 216. There you go, mate. Thank you very much. Let's go and try this. I say try it. I've tried it before, but you guys haven't seen it on the old YouTube, so I'm going to do it for you guys. Let's go. Right, shout out to the Squishy. Let's go, mate. Right, 7-Eleven in the background. Big up to them. Mate, it was literally... I think it was two. I think it was two fifty or three. I don't know. I can't remember. Look at the video anyway. It was about two or three dollars. Absolutely incredible. So cheap. Right. Let's go. Oh, mate. Mmm. Oh my word. Literally, the best frozen slushy drink I've ever had in my life. It's like a a Fanta Frozen or a Tango Ice Blast. I don't know if they still do them, but yeah, absolutely incredible. Much better though, way better. Mm. Look at the size of that. It's literally like the size of my head. Oh my God. Mm. Mate, absolutely incredible. So cheap as well. Like, I literally cannot believe this is under $3. Can you believe that? Unreal, cheaper than water. I'm not surprised that they're addicted to all this food. Unreal, mate. Mate, in the baking hot sun as well, this is cooling me down so much. Probably about a million grams of sugar in here, but do you know what? I don't care, I'm not gonna have these every day, so forget it. When in Vegas, you know what I mean? I genuinely, look, I feel like I've drunk loads, and it hasn't even, hasn't even touched the sides, mate. It's still right at the top. I'm definitely not gonna be able to drink all of this. No way, mate. You know what, since I've been here, I've barely eaten any fruit and I feel like I need a bit of fruit. So I've just stumbled across this guy selling fruit in the street and he's got watermelon. That's the main thing. Hello, you're right, mate. Can I just have a, just watermelon on its own? One watermelon? How much is, how much is one of these? How much for one? Ten. Ooh. That's a bit much, right? Never mind, thank you. Yeah, uh, never mind. <laughs> I'm not paying $10 for one cup of fruit. That is absolutely extortionate. You can tell that I was a tourist. I bet that's why. Bet it's a fiver for the locals. So since I can remember, I've always wanted to try In-N-Out Burger. I see so many people talking about it, always hear it in films and like series, always referenced. So I'm gonna try that. Apparently it's really, really cheap as well. Like two to four dollars for a burger. And pff, to be honest with you, that's an absolutely cracking deal. So we're currently at the Link Promenade. We got the high roller behind us. This is probably one of the nicest places in the whole of the Las Vegas Strip. Just look around. There we go, in and out. I didn't even see that there, lovely stuff. Right, let's go and get a bloody hamburger. Mate, this better be nice. I've heard so much about it. Better be nice. Right, let's have a little look, see how much it is. Oh, okay. Oh, $4.35 for a cheeseburger. That is not too bad. Hey, right, can I just get uh, one double-double? Uh, yeah, just, actually no, can I just get a cheeseburger, please? Okay, will you Uh No, just the cheeseburger on its own, please. Okay, what are you uh, take away, please. Lovely, thank you very much. Right, here we go. We've got the cheeseburger on the way. I was gonna get the double-double, but I thought I wanna keep it as budget as possible. And $6 for one burger, I wouldn't call that budget, do you know what I mean? So, 4 35 yeah, that's fair enough. I feel like I've been transported back to like the 40s or something. Look at this kitchen. Proper old school. Oh man, it smells absolutely delicious. I'm seeing people pick up their orders. Oh man, it looks so good. Mate, when I tell you it is absolutely rammed in here. Must be a popular place. Uh, 28. 28. Thank you. Lovely, cheers, thank you very much, mate. Right guys, here we are. The In-N-Out Cheeseburger. The famous In-N-Out Cheeseburger. Oh my God, this looks absolutely incredible. Oh my God. Just look at that, oh my days. Right, let me take that tomato out, because, yeah, we don't need a tomato in a burger. Makes it far too soggy. Love lettuce, love onions, all of that, but tomato, yeah, that can get gone. Right, just put that in the bin. Right, let's go. First time ever trying in and out Let's go, oh my God. I'm so excited, this looks amazing. Mm. 
Mmm. Oh my god, that sauce. I don't even know what sauce that is. It tastes like burger sauce, but like a little bit different to burger sauce. The patties are a little bit thin, but still amazing. But they're cheap, so they're gonna be thinner burgers. Oh my god. That's one of the best fast food burgers I've ever had. Four dollars for that. That's pretty decent. On a normal day, I would have got a double, but I wanted to keep it budget for the video. Do you know what, actually? Funnily enough, it reminds me of the Fibo vending machine burger from Amsterdam. It tastes very, very similar, to be honest, but a lot nicer. Oh, mate, honestly, I can see why so many people rant and rave on about that boy. That was superb. A little bit thin, a little bit small burger patty, but to be honest, delicious. I would go and get about three more to be like, I could smash three or four more of them, but you know, got to keep it budget, so we've got to keep it on the down low, you know? Keep the money on the down low, on the DL. So this place here, Casino Royale, apparently has a really, really cheap food court. So I'm gonna go and check that out. Yeah, boy. Whilst we're on the topic of eating very, very typical American food, yeah, that's a bit of me, mate. 3 49 that is nothing. Hi there, can I just get one foot long hot dog, please? One just to make? Uh, yeah, just one beef hot dog, please. Okay. Nice one, cheers, thank you very much. Here's all the hot dogs turning on the machine. They've also got corn dogs as well. I've had a corn dog before. They're, uh, they're okay, they're not, not that great. Don't really like them, but these sausages look decent, to be fair. Decent size, mate, 3 49 it's really not that bad. Right, I'm not making the same mistake and putting mustard on it. Last time I put mustard on a hot dog in New York, it was absolutely rubbish, but I'm gonna put some ketchup on it. Right, let's go. Just a wee bit. Yes. Right, let's go find a little seating area. Oh, it's seating down here. Right, guys, we got the footlong beef hot dog. Oh, shout out the beef hot dog, keeping it halal. I think I actually prefer beef hot dogs anyway, to be honest, right. Short and sweet, keeping it nice and simple, okay. That's good. Hey, you know what, guys? Nice soft hot dog roll. Nice, uh, fresh-ish hot dog. Doesn't taste like it's been there for hours. It tastes uh, fairly fresh, to be fair. Ketchup, nice and tangy. I didn't want to get mustard, man. American mustard is so hit or miss. Sometimes it's okay, but most of the time, it's not great. Mate, size of that as well. 3.49, ah, fair play. Mm. Obviously, it's not like gourmet, but you get what you pay for, innit? Well, that was pretty cheap and cheerful, to be fair. Not bad, 3.49, can't go wrong. Right guys, so I've been absolutely smashing the savory today, but now my sweet tooth is just starting to protrude a little bit. So I'm gonna have a little wander around and look for some cheap sweet treats. I don't really know what I'm gonna get. I haven't really looked anywhere, so I'm just gonna have a little wander. Ooh, what have we got here? Duck donuts. Seems like a bit of a rip off from Dunkin' Donuts, but F it, we'll give it a go. <laughs> oh, cinnamon bun donut. I don't think I've ever heard of that. I'm not gonna lie, that is calling my name. Cinnamon sugar with vanilla drizzle. Ooh, yeah, that's the one. Hey, right, mate, can I just get one cinnamon bun donut, please? Would you like anything else or just the one? Uh, just the one, please. 515, please. And then can I have an Uh, it's Charlie. There you go, nice one. Can I just wait down here? Yeah, perfect. Thank you very much, mate. Cheers, thank you. Oh, look at this. This is the making station. All the artificial flavorings and colorings. Delicious though, absolutely delicious. Said it'll be a few minutes, so uh, yeah, I guess we'll just uh, have a little scope out of this place. Look at all the ducks, mate. Ducking hell. Cool, what did he do? <laughs> Seems a bit dark. Oof, nice and fresh. Can't beat fresh hot donuts, honestly. Mate, why do they have mayonnaise and ketchup sachets for donuts? That is absolutely sickening. That's that's literally turning my stomach. What what is going on there? Wait, look how many ducks they've got here. It's actually mad. Boy, look. Got a bloody football duck. Might have to just uh, might have to just take that. You know what I mean? <laughs> Mate, even got an alien duck. I don't, I don't know which one's better. I just can't decide. Uh, can, yeah, can I get it in the box to go? Uh, how much are the ducks as well? Three twenty-five. Oh, okay. Gotta do it. Gotta do it. I gotta do it. I gotta do it. I gotta do it. Three twenty-five. That is an absolute bargain. <laughs> Love it. Oh, that's absolutely perfect, mate. Thank you. And I'll buy the duck as well, please. Nice one. Thank you very much. Cheers. Perfect. Have a nice Thank you very much. You too, man. Thank you. Right here we go, guys. The big reveal. We've got duck donuts in the background, mate. I had to get the alien duck. I literally had to, mate. It's three twenty-five. It's part of the budget video. Right. Let's go. Big reveal. Oh man, oh my god, that smells literally 
incredible. Cheers. Oh my God. Mm. Mm. I'm angry, that's how good it is. Oh my goodness, that's literally the best donut I've ever had in my life. Mm. Mate, fresh donuts, you can't beat them. Mate, cinnamon sugar and vanilla goes perfectly with this. It's like a cinnamon roll or a, a cinnamon swirl or something, but donut, oh my God. Mm. Mm. Oh, I like this one. Oh my god. Literally. 40 seconds. <laughs> Done. That's how good that is. Oh my god. Mate, shout out to Duck Donuts. Best donut I've had in my life. Factual. Right, let's go. Oh my goodness me. Right, I need to find the bin. Right, there we go. Straight away. Mate, got my little alien duck as well. I'm absolutely loving it. Ooh, what's this we got, guys? Nice little food court. Del Taco. Do you know what? Fancy a taco as well. Yeah, let's give it a little go. Yeah, why not? I reckon the tacos will be fairly cheap. It's only a taco, isn't it? Right, here we go, guys. Let's have a look how much this is. Ooh. Ooh, it looks fairly cheap, to be honest. Ooh. $2.99. That's decent. There we go, sorted. Grilled chicken or beef? It's gotta be the beef, in it? Yeah, crunchy as well. Yeah, let's have a bit of that, why not? Oof. Mate, this looks banging. Cheap as anything, mate. 2.99, that is ridiculous. All right, right, could I just get one crunchy Del Taco with beef, please? No sour cream with that? Uh, just everything apart from cheese, please. No cheese? No cheese, yeah, thank you. And your name? Uh, Charlie, nice one, thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Oh, mate. Absolutely lovely. Came to 350 in the end because of the tax and all that, but still 350, definitely within the budget. Thank you very much. Now I'm okay. Thank you. Cheers. Boy, let's go, boy. Lovely stuff. Right, here we go, guys. We've got the Del Taco. Let's absolutely smash this. Oof. There we go. Look at this, guys. Oh. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Let's absolutely smash this. You know what? I like chicken and I like beef tacos, but beef just edges it, I think. Like, just. Oh, this is very, very messy, but I'm gonna try and eat this as uh, respectfully as I can. Mmm. Wow. Oh my God. Mmm. Mmm. Absolutely loaded with tomatoes, lettuce, sour cream, obviously beef inside as well. Oh my God. Oh, so succulent, not dry at all. I feel like sometimes when you get tacos right, especially crispy ones for some reason, it's just a bit, a bit dry. Damn, son. That is one of the best tacos I've ever had. Honestly, guys, I'm just exhausted from eating all day. Honestly, I feel like eating loads and loads of food just makes me crash hardcore. But honestly, pretty much everything in this video has been stupendous. The cynics claimed it was impossible. The haters said it wouldn't happen. But today, I don't think we've even spent $50 on everything. Absolutely unbelievable. Like the video, subscribe if you're new. Gang, gang, let's go. <laughs> gang, 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 gang. <laughs> yeah, boy. <laughs>